Well, among the millions of mysteries that the universe contains is the mystery of an object in space that has been inexplicably dimming and brightening and dimming and brightening. It's got scientists mystified. So we called on National Geographic astronomy columnist Andrew Fazekas, as we often do at times such as this. Andrew joins us on this Sunday from Montreal. Good to see you, Andrew. What may be causing this? I've had Christmas lights do something similar to this over the holidays. Uh, I knew what to do with those, but what do you make of this? Yeah, this is a mystery that's been ongoing now for uh, about six years. Uh, that a, uh, This is a star called Tabby Star, named after the astronomer who, who discovered it. Um, it's a star that's dimming in brightness, very unusually. And uh, Kepler's exoplanet Hunter uh, satellite spotted these uh, very irregular dips in starlight. At first, they thought it was probably a planet that was going in front of it, because that's what the planet Hunter Kepler has been doing, has raked up over 3,000 planets. But the dipping in starlight it, we discovered very quickly it was not made uh, by a planet going in front of the star, causing it to wink out. Oh. And it turned out that it's something of a mystery. We could not explain what these dips in light were, were coming from this star that's, that's sitting about 1,200 light years away from Earth. Now, a new study came out just this week after having looked at it intensely with the most powerful telescopes in the world at all different wavelengths of light. And we think that the cause of this very unusual dipping is not from alien structures. I know all those uh, alien aficionados out there might be, yes. might be a little I was bit thinking, I was thinking the same thing, Andrew. I was thinking to myself, maybe somebody's <laughs> trying to communicate with us. Now, it looks like it might be some kind of natural phenomenon, perhaps uh, a, a collision between two smaller planets that have become pulverized into very minute dust that is circling this star that's causing this irregular dip in starlight but it looks like it's dust but there's still a mystery though we don't know where this dust exactly is coming it could be from pulverized plants but it just doesn't ex still we can't explain where the dust is coming from so there's no alien megastructures right. that are circling this planet like we had you know one one scientist postulated but it could very well be some very strange form of dust a ring of dust in clumps around the star. But the mystery still is still there. We don't know where the, this dust originates from. It's acting very be peculiarly. You know, it's very interesting that this mystery exists, but I guess on the brighter side of things, Andrew, it almost certainly assures job security, right? <laughs> <laughs> exactly. National, you're still, National you're Geographic. Still gonna be looking at it. <laughs> National Geographic astronomy columnist Andrew Fizekas. Always a pleasure, my friend. Clear skies.